a short video on uh, how we uh, set up a 600 yard target in the field planner class. Field planner class, which we now do by uh, private class only request. Um, you need to set up a 600 yard target on a range where you don't have a range finder. So you got to figure out uh, how to get that location pinned down. And with that information, we will then show you how to construct a manual trajectory chart without any kind of ballistic app at all. Uh, all the only electronics you'll have in this class is a um, standalone calculator. Okay, target size in inches times 27.77 divided by mils gives us yards. I think most of you may know that already. But what we need to do is kind of switch this equation around a little bit and we're going to go down range and look back at a target of known size at the firing line until we find the 600 yard point. Use something at least 36 inches across. The larger the target, the uh, less a minor amount of um, calculation error will matter. The width of the grill on our pickup, our old Ford F-250, is uh, 42 and a half inches across. So if we do 42 and a half inches times a constant of 27.77 divided by X, which would be the mils, we'll get 600. So this is uh, going to help us decide what we should be milling this truck grill at when we are at 600 yards. I'm not a mathematician, but uh, this is kind of basic. And I may be structuring this a little funky, but this is how I do it. It works for me. Uh, 42 and a half times 27.77 is going to give you 1180.225. So 1180.225 divided by X gives you 600. All right, let's get rid of this 600 here. The way I do it, I just divide each side of the equation by 600. That's going to give you 1 over here. Divide 1180.225 by 600. That gives 1.967 mils. So basically 1.967 mils divided by X equals 1. That means X is 1.967 mils. Any mathematicians out there tell me I did it wrong, just leave a comment about it or whatever, but uh, if this works. So um, this gives us this number. So we need to move down range little by little until we find that truck grill or whatever target it is you set up at the firing line is measuring about that amount, 1.967. Uh, that's going to be hard to tell from two mils even. Uh, on most scopes, but this is going to get you pretty close to 600 yards and with that number you can then begin uh, constructing a manual trajectory chart which we teach you how to do in the field planner class. Bankstil.com, check us out.